I have some complaints about the store that I work at. Uh, my store that I work at is uh, Kroger's L720 in uh, Lexington, Kentucky. Um, my complaints range from the store manager to the employees to uh, some of the customers. Um, the store manager is cold, emotionally detached from the employees. Uh, he uh, he just seems more focused on the uh, the uh, running of the store, and he doesn't seem to really care much about all the employees. Uh, there's some that he does care for, and then there's some that he doesn't. Um, he seems more uh, focused with the job at hand. Um, and then there comes customer service manager, uh, who basically personally told me that he wouldn't add me as a friend on Facebook, and he didn't really want to associate me with me because um, he wanted to be friends with the cool people. Uh, he didn't think I was interesting enough to uh, to add on, and I really took that as a, a front. And then there's the um, the head checkout clerk. Uh, I think she has a disorder of some type. I'm not sure because um, she she treats people who are bagging for her uh, really poorly, and uh, she she can be happy in one second. And then turn around the next second and be as mean as a snake. Uh, she uh, she just treats people badly, and uh, sometimes she can have an attitude with the customers, especially if they get mean toward her. Uh, she she just doesn't really um, seem to uh, treat people that well. I think she needs some retraining or uh, seriously look at her job status. Uh, the union, uh, I don't think they really uh, do much for you. They side with the employer for most for most everything. Um, they um, the management gets the right to assign the work conditions, the uh, the uh, levels of pay. They get to assign um, the uh, duties that you're supposed to do and uh, the pay rates um, they don't really allow you to do much um, the union uh, the union does do some things but I think that they're mainly, mainly for full time people part time people really don't matter except for, as a cash cow for the union just produces a whole lot of money for them and the only time that they really do something for you is when uh, you're uh, basically about to get fired or really severely disciplined. Then they do something for you. But rather than that, they just you're just not really that important to them. Um, my general complaints about this store is um, it has too much of a relaxed atmosphere. It doesn't really seem very business-like. Uh, like uh, the employees, uh, not including myself, uh, a lot of times read uh, magazines while they're w waiting for people to check out. Uh, they talk to each other while they're checking people out. Um, they um, they um, they go over to the customer service desk and just congregate there and talk a lot. Um, there's a lot of favoritism in place at this store. Um, I think certain people get uh, the things they want uh, out of the store, uh, like they can get, you know, certain hours they want to work. Uh, they can get, uh, you know, certain types of food, drinks that they want, um, and uh, there's. There's just a lot of things that they, these employees can do, like buying things on the clock, um, you know, uh, just things like that that would and get calling in sick and uh, you know faking sick to go home, uh, things that would really get the ordinary person fired. But for these, for whatever reason, they don't get reprimanded, fired, or anything. Um, 
the rules just kind of fall apart in the store. Uh, the rules that people are supposed to follow just really fall apart. Uh, it's just too relaxed. Uh, I think it needs to be more structured like a business environment. Um, customer service isn't really good during high volume times. Um, they, they, they just don't seem to have enough people working at the store to, uh, to, um, to handle all the volume during high business hours. You can get like sometimes five or six people waiting in line and they only have like maybe one or two people up at the service desk actually helping anybody. Um, I just think that's crazy. Um, and the customers, um, usually, uh, the customers are nice, they're cooperative, uh, they appreciate your business and that kind of thing, but there are some that are picky and mean, and there are some that try to play the right card, uh, saying they're always right. Um, some of them expect you to do too much. Uh, they expect you to always be perfect, and they really pounce on you if you make a mistake, and um, that kind of thing. And some of them just have like uh, just too much of an opinion. Uh, and uh, I know I can't really change anything about the customers, but uh, sometimes it just seems like that. Um, that we we could be treated nicer. Uh, we're we're not just things. We we should have the right to be treated like you know people. And uh, that really just sums up uh, my complaints about the store. I don't know if this video is really going to get anywhere, but uh, I thought I would uh, put my uh, opinions online and just see where what they got. Thank. You.